Um, <clears throat> how did you feel when you put on your Drax persona and returned to the Guardians universe? Uh, I felt great. I felt uh, I felt at home. I felt comfortable. It just uh, it was really a luxury to have to be able to step into the same character for a second time. You know, it's something that I hadn't had in the past, and it just you know, it's kind of kind of a gift. And what do you like best to work <coughs> about working with this talented crew? Well, uh, that they're my friends. You know, to be honest with you, it's not. I don't feel like it's. I don't look at it as work. It doesn't feel like work. It feels like I'm hanging out with my buddies. Yeah. Uh, where do we find Drax now, and has he changed in any way? Uh, you find Drax in a much more content place in his life. You know, he hasn't changed. <laughs> I think he's trying to change a little bit, but I think m more than anything, I think Drax is just, he's just found happiness again. I think he just was void of happiness for so long, and I think he's just found a glimpse of happiness again. Uh, can you tell us about Drax's relationship with the other Guardians in the film? Uh, I think they're his, you know, they're his new family. You know, I think he loves them every every bit as his family that he's lost. Uh, I think he's still mourning over the family that he lost, but I think he's found his new family. You know, and that is where he's found his happiness. Uh, Drax and Mantis form a bond. What is that relationship like? I like to look at Drax and Mantis as, uh, you know, as siblings. <laughs> I think Drax has, has appointed himself uh, Big Brother. I think he's appointed himself as a mentor to Mantis. <laughs> I don't think she, you know, really sees him in that, but I think that's the role he's, in his head, that he's taken on. Uh, can you talk a little bit about working with Palm and what that was like? Palm's amazing. Palm's, is, uh, Palm's uh, range as an actress is, her emotional range is extensive. Um, it's, it's impressive. Um, I, the thing I love the most about her is she has um, the strength that I have, and that's delivering a very funny line in a very deadpan manner. <laughs> and I think when you get two characters that, that are doing that, I think it just makes for a lot of funny moments. But we have uh, great chemistry, which we found out in the screen test together. Um, and she has just such a great quirkiness about her as a person and as a performer. So it just it makes for a really, really strong character, but really strong chemistry between Drax and Mantis. Uh, what do you like best about Drax? I, you know, well, the thing I, I like best about Drax is he's brutally honest. The thing I hate about Drax is he's brutally honest. <laughs> yeah. Your makeup process and look changed. Tell us about uh, this new makeup and the process and what you like about it. So what I like about the new makeup process is that it's much shorter. It's only about an hour and a half, and it looks amazing. It looks much better in the first film. Uh, what I hate about it is it's, it's really hard to take off. <laughs> really hard to take off. Uh, what can audiences expect from Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2? Uh, I think what people can expect is uh, an amazing story. I think, um, you know, they'll get to know and love the characters even more. Uh, get to explore a, a more of their past and their relationships with, with siblings and maternal figures, paternal figures. Um, but I think overall, there's just a really strong, strong message of, of family and love for family in this film. If you had to sum up your experience making this film in one word, what would it be and why? Um, if I had to sum up the experience of making the film, uh, I would say just, I would say easy. You know, and I, I, that sounds like such a stupid answer, but it was just so, easy it just uh i knew the cast members they were just my friends and and i loved them and the same with the director he was just my friends and he just he wrote so brilliantly for us i mean we just there wasn't a lot of discovery that had to be made we just it was all handed to us i mean it was just it's so easy 